No going back. Yo, low-key, I feel like Aerie's actually not bad into LeBlanc. Because you guys know how I always say, like, the only keystone that's good into LeBlanc is Electrocute, because of you're, you're never really going to have extended trades against her, right? Like, there's no reason to ever go Conquer into her. Tragic. Uh, so Aerie might just be the best option, man. Just try to heal up. Only fools hesitate. Like at least with Aerie, I can just like poke her like that, you know? He has no clone now, so I can actually go f look for a kill. Oh, I'm tilted. I'm so tilted, actually. How does my Q cancel? Dude, this is gonna crash before I even get back, so I ha I have to fucking stay. This is so sad. Oh, that's actually awful for me. I mean, at least we trade flashes, but that should be a kill. My wave's just like really fucked. Oh, it's all good. Bro, I'm literally gonna base for a Doran's ring. And this. That's so tragic. I mean, initially it's just bad, right? Because I thought I was in range for my E flash, but I was slightly out of range. So if you guys don't know this, I mean, you should by now, if you've been playing Katarina, this has been an interaction for, well, ever since she was released. Even with the older versions of Katarina, you can actually combine your flash and your E. So you can buff your E on them and then flash into your E range. And it'll just look like it's a really long uh, shampoo. And that's what I tried to do, but I was slightly out of range. Just slightly. So, uh, yeah, it was harder to eat onto her. Got you, bro. Never play safe. Oh.
I'll be a so broken. I don't really agree with that. She's definitely like okay right now. I mean, I have a lot of success uh, on her whenever I play player on my main. I have so much success. Yeah, this is my my smurf. The MMR is like low low master tier. No, it's high masters, low GM, I believe. If you OPG this game, you'll probably see like a few 300 uh, LP master tiers like last game. Just chilling for tonight, you know, not really trying hard. Just uh, just trying out airy, you know, why not? Do a little bit of poking. Yo, Imperial. Thank you for the five years of subs, man. I appreciate it. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much. Nice, really good trade. Don't be afraid to use your ult like that, guys. Just for a trade. Because now I actually have kill pressure on this guy. Sometimes you just get solo killed, man, as a uh, wonk when you're playing against Airy Katarina. Well, now we got the pen boots, so hopefully this will allow us to do a little bit more damage to her. Bro, she didn't expect the airy damage. What can I tell her? What? what can I tell you, man? He didn't expect the airy damage plus the scorch with ignite. Another really good trade. Bring her down to a killable HP. No, I just missed that cannon to trade with her there, which is fine. No going back. The fuck? Why can't I Q her before I shun put out? I actually would be able to kill her right now with my Q being back up. Keep friends close and enemy. An enemy has been slain. I should have just kept running at her and then like E flash. Uh, well, I guess a griefer. I think this is a Rocky Belt game. I like 
Maybe, I mean, then again, we do have the components for Ludens, so we could just rush Ludens, even though I don't think that's optimal. We'll see. We'll see. It doesn't seem too bad, right, guys? Like, it's actually not that bad, damage-wise, as long as you can queue your laner a lot. Look at that one Q, by the way. Like, that's so fucked. <laughs> oh man, this guy's being fucking dumpstered. I feel bad for him. I think it's a Rocket Belt game. Actually, you know, I'm down for the Ludens, bro. I really am, but at the same time, it's like... I don't really get anything from building that right here, you know? It's whatever, it's whatever. Let's just do it. An alternative would be like, yeah, of course, possibly Night Harvester would synergize with this. But at the same time, I don't want the CDR passive. I want as much pen as possible, right? So Ludens is going to give us that. It's going to synergize really well with our poke Q. Why? And at the same time, it's going to um, give us pen, so... I'm griefing. Oh, he cleaned up though. It's all good. Only fools has it. Your team has destroyed a turret. No going back. <laughs> we got Stevie Wonder on Vibe, bro. Nice. Take out the Magi's here. Good job, team. Now we run even faster with the Magi's. That's so dead today. Yeah, I mean, it's just because I'm not streaming at my normal time. You know, I'm streaming at fucking 7 p.m., whereas. Uh, people just know I usually stream in the morning, so Now we're gonna have less uh, viewers at this time of day, which is fine. I don't really mind Live. 
through all that. That's just sad. I feel bad for the enemy team. I should have died like 10 times over there. That's just, that's just so sad. <laughs> Just go fucking decap next or what? No going back. It's actually not that bad of a build. Believe it or not. I, I actually this is like okay. Only fools hesitate. Oh my god. That's that was a good recon knock up. My god. I'm fun. Imagine how tilted they are too, because they probably think Aerie is just so troll. And they're just probably like spam pinging it and just like harassing their LeBlanc online for losing to Aerie, Katarina. Bro, I'm selling my D-ring now for this death cap. I want it for this dragon fight. I want to see my damage before they FF inevitably. Go. 505 AP right now. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. Got him.
Nice. Twenty one point four K damage, okay. It was actually also a pretty good uh airy game. Nice, we got two airy Katarina games. That was that's that's lit. Okay. I like that. It seemed okay, at least in these kind of matchups. You know, like last game I played it into a Yone, and then this game I played it into a LeBlanc, and it felt pretty good into both of them. Although, of course, my laners were just misplaying left and right, still, it felt better than uh, like Electrocute in those matchups, at least, because I can just walk up and poke them and then back off.